here he is. The one, the only, Jacob Jones, our player of the match. Congratulations, Jacob. Uh, how did it feel to finally score this season there early on in, in the first half? Uh, man, it felt a lot better than the last game. Uh, last game was a little, a little rough for me, but glad I got one back on the sheets. So it, it looked like both you and Wade, you, you saw gaps there between the defender and the goalkeeper, and you made them pay, and all of a sudden it was 2 nothing early, and it seemed like things were going well. And then this was one of the more unusual games, obviously, with a player down and an ambulance coming in, and then you had to get refreshed. But a lot of yellow cards, you kind of got one yourself, and uh, this is typical NAIA soccer, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I mean, to be fair, I don't think it was a yellow, but... <laughs> It is what it is. So uh, Sports Information Director Jordan Brown uh, let us know that your goal was your 28th and 6th all-time in park history. I know you're not a, a record keeper, but as you reflect on your park career and what, what got you here, uh, what are you going to take away from your time as a, as a member of the uh, Park Pirates soccer program? Um, I mean, I'm very thankful that Coach Ephraim let me come back and have my second chance and uh the fact that he believed in me and you know i'm been out here trying to prove myself i appreciate them and i appreciate the whole program so we saw something that we hadn't seen all year you and moha on the field together uh and it looked like they were really playing moha tight uh as you head into ottawa and uh, a totally different type of game expecting uh what can we expect with you and moha on the field at the same time together um, I'm hoping he's doing, you know, his typical Moha stuff where he draws the, the attention and then I can pop up with the ball on the backside wide open and hopefully get a couple goals. But I enjoy playing with him. He's a great player and hopefully I can return the favor for him. So started with a loss, two home wins, an opportunity to start with some momentum heading into the heart. What can we expect about this season heading into the heart? I know what we saw last year. Um... I mean, as long as we can uh, fix our little mistakes here and there, I mean, we got a, a veteran team, as they call it, and I know I think this is the year that we can actually do something, so I'm hoping we can just keep pushing and you know, not have as many mistakes each game and just get, get something done this year. Good to see last Saturday night. First ever Saturday night uh, game under the lights, which is pretty cool. Some of your, your – teammates from from the days of your were here which was kind of fun to see them some cheering for you and so uh as we wrap this up uh i know there's been people watching literally all throughout the world i saw uh daniel arias uh, father checking in on instagram any final words for the pirate nation watching at home um i appreciate you all watching and supporting you know, i wish you guys were all here but you know, any support will take it so i appreciate it thank you to my family and my fiance that's right. He knows what he's talking about. You've heard from your player of the match, senior forward Jacob Jones, scoring in the fourth minute, also earning his 28th goal, making him sixth all-time in Park Pirates soccer history. You just watched another Park University victory on the Hard Conference Network. I'm Eric Berger. This is Jacob Jones. We'll be back here two weeks from tonight.